at first we are going to start with the PS2. PS2 used for all keyboard and mouse. Green one, the green plug, uh, it is for the mouse and the purple one is for the keyboard. New versions of the modules have one port which you can connect uh, the mouse and the old keyboard. For after, for example, five years, uh, PS2 becomes that, but now nowadays motherboards didn't support PS2 because uh, we cannot use it, and the old mouse and keyboards sorry passed it. Okay. Number two. Number two is serial port. Uh, it used for transforming data. I uh, used it for connecting a printer and, for example, sharing share with some different receivers. Uh, it used for that. VGA number three VGA graphic port. We connect this to the monitor and use it to see and capture our desktop and see the OS. It is an image output port. We have different image output ports such as DVI, HDMI, and DP. DP is a new one image output. It is new. And some, sometimes we use, we use type C port to, uh, we use type C port as an image output port. Sometimes you use it and DP is a new one, is a new one, and the complete name of that is the display port, is a new one. After that, we have USB port. Number four is USB port. We have different generations of the USB ports. We have generation one port, generation three port. By default, the general color is the general color for the PS2 type 2 port or I can say PS2 Gen 2 port is black and we have generation 3 and USB type 3 we call them USB type 3 uh, USB type 3 has it has a generation inside that for example USB type 3.1 or I can say generation 1 and generation 2 uh, it shows these USB 3 ports shows by blue and red. It depends on the company that create the motherboard. We can see these ports uh, with blue color and the red color. After that, we have LAN port. LAN port is using for put your network cable on the computer so you can download and upload and connect to your network. It's used for that. After that, we have audio card output. Some motherboards have three output cards uh, and other of, some other of the computers have six output audio cards. Uh, we call them Dolby. Dolby, for example, when you use Dolby, you can hear the sound in different ways and it used for example gamer use this and the studios use this type of art I will create a video for that don't forget to like this video after that uh, let me see we have another audio port which is digital audio port it is like fiber optic and it's used for audio output cards. Some different audio card output cards use this. After this, we have USB type C plug in nowadays motherboards. And it, it is like USB and we use it for transferring data, charge this device, for example, charge your phone and use this for all justice. Most of the motherboards have these parts on their back side of the panel. So this is all of the common things between them. Have a nice day. I hope you like this video. Don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel.